If you're planning on buying any cards from TCG Player, make sure you use our affiliate link right here in the description of our video to help support the channel. It's the best way to do it and it's free. Make sure you check out Poton Store. They have the new certain shield codes already available and they have automatic email delivery for these codes. You can get them in batches of 50 codes with a slight discount or individually for 89 cents each. They also have all these other promo codes. They have um, every other set you could imagine. And if you use Tailbone code, you get 5% off your final purchase. For the European players, Millibuds Gaming has everything from collectibles to all the latest cards from the latest sets, Cosmic Eclipse, Hidden Fates, and everything from Sun and Moon. Don't forget to check it out and use Tailbone code when checking out in order to get 5% off your final purchase. Welcome back to a brand new day of Road to Teacher World 2020, where Rookie, thank you so much for the follow. We are now moving on to more Pico, where um, we have the Spark Attack, with um, which deals 20 damage to active and 20 damage to a bench Pokemon. Nothing too impressive, but Electro Wheel dealing 150 damage. <clears throat> Discard an energy from this Pokemon if you to switch it with one of your bench Pokemon. We already saw an action against us. I feel like uh, if my opponent's list had been built a little bit different, we definitely should have lost that game. So hopefully this list will be a little cleaner and a little more um, effective. But um, but yeah, <clears throat> Electro Wheel 150 and you switch. You discard an energy from a Pico and then you switch into one of your benched Pokemon. So which bench Pokemon do we have? We have Coco V with a high HP. <coughs> and a free retreat, we also have four Lilies Pokedol, right? So we're gonna be playing around with that. <coughs> and we do have the Recycle Energies to use as targets for the discard so that we don't end up in a situation where we don't have enough energy attached or we can't actually continually attack. Now we have the more Pico V Max as well, dealing three, uh, with 300 HP, a huge amount of HP. We have the Max Discharge Attack, dealing 180 and 20 more damage to each of your opponent's bench Pokemon. But with the memory energy that we do run, we can start using Electro Wheel with the 300 HP monster. Now we have Zapdos for added pressure, we have Coco Prism for energy acceleration, we have Absols, we have Jirachis, we have Mimikyu, and we have Oricorio for whenever one of our Pokemon gets knocked out. We also have the Lucky X to combine with the Lily's Pokedol so that when they go down we get hand refresh and we never miss a beat. Um, we have a bunch of supporters including uh, four Volkner, one Rosa, one Marty, one. Who's Mahalo, one Cynthia, and one Beide. So Beide is here making its first appearance. You can attach a basic energy card from your hand to one of your bench Pokemon. We won't always have Thunder Mountain in play. Beide helps us power up a second more Pico in case the first one goes down. So I do think it's worth it as a one-off here. And of course, we also have four Custom Catchers and two Pokemon Catchers to make sure that we are targeting the right Pokemon. And we finish the games as quickly as possible because our energies... Um, like, it's difficult to power up two more Pico. A third one is very unlikely unless your opponent doesn't play any stadiums and thunder mountain sticks for basically the whole game then it's gonna be quite tough so yeah that's the idea behind the deck let's jump into a ladder and see what we can do and maybe there's something wrong with the chat because there's no new messages but let's continue playing let's continue playing Right. All right, so Rillaboom, maybe? Grass Dragon, Alolan Executor, maybe? I honestly don't know. I honestly don't know. Uh, my opponent wins the coin flip and chooses to go first. I insist that my opponents are continually, continually making a mistake by doing this, but to each their own, right? To each their own. I will bench the more Pico. If it gets costed, that's fine. Not the biggest of deals. <coughs> and we're up against <clears throat> a grass ADP base deck. What? I have no clue. 
Eh, aún no he jugado Frostmoth, Manu. Aún no he jugado Frostmoth. And Rafa Rubén, thank you so much for the extra 100 bits. That is very, very kind of you. As always, thank you so, so much. Okay, so I'm gonna Volkner for this and energy. I think that's pretty important. We do have Rosa. Now I get to Stella Wish for another Volkner. I think that makes sense. <coughs> and so I'm gonna start with the damage on this guy, right? Just to soften it up a little bit. And let's go for the spark. 20 damage, plus 10 from the shrine. Not sure what stadiums my opponent's playing. Hopefully not chaotic as well, but if it is, then it's no big deal. If it is there, it's no big deal. <laughs> There's a notification. Oh no, an extra 100 bits. Wow, Rafa, thank you so much. Thank you so, so much for the support. I really, really do appreciate it. I really, really do. Wait and see hammer. Power plant, choice helmet, and unit energy. All right. <coughs> I still have no clue what my opponent is playing. I still have absolutely no clue what my opponent is playing. There's the altar creation, however. Choice helmet should definitely not be a card my opponent plays. Um, okay, so I definitely think... Uh, Volkner for energy and Lily's poke it all it's good here so I'll go ahead and attach I'll go ahead and switch and then I'll still wish uh, BD is a little too late for that quick ball is quick ball even useful what does quick ball get me Coco prism but that's not great uh, so I I generally think it's just another poke doll right Just another Pokédoll, that's fine. So let's bench them both. And let's go ahead and retreat. And then we will pass. And then... <clears throat> Does my opponent have greens into double custom catcher into KO more Pico V? Is that a thing? There's just a grass energy and there's the ultimate ray that's perfectly okay by me. I generally think Choice Helmet is a bad card now. It should be Big Amulet because it doesn't protect, it doesn't reduce the damage from V Pokemon. So overall, it's not fantastic. It seems to be Green's ADP and <laughs> Ruben. Thank you so much for the extra 100 bits. Very, very, very kind of you. Very, very kind of you. Huge shout out to Ruben for the amazing support. Um, okay, so this is pretty solid. I'm gonna go ahead and Rosa here, and I'm just gonna go up to 300 HP. Why not, right? Why wouldn't I want to go to 300 HP? And then I'm kind of feeling the Lucky Egg here. I am actually kind of feeling the Lucky Egg, so I'm gonna go Memory Energy, and I go Evolve. I should be doing this in the... the I should be establishing first, right? Before I play all those cards, before I commit to all those cards. Um, yeah, I'll just grab another dog. Why not? Let's bench the doll. Let's go Lucky Egg on this doll. That's the one that's gonna be active. I feel like I won't lose anything by benching the Absol. And therefore, let's go Electro Wheel. 150 with discard a Lightning, that's fine. And then if this Pokédoll gets discarded, we get seven fresh new cards. Not bad. Seven fresh, fresh new cards. All right. <coughs> <coughs> There's a Poke Gear. There's the Poke Gear. All right. Tackle, Puzzle for Hermosa, Malolana, that's fine. I do need, well, I don't need to, but I, it would be nice to find my recycle energy sometime soon. So this guy's gone for sure, right? This guy's gone for sure with what I have in my hand. And that's fantastic. I draw my extra cards, that's great. Thank you so much, Ruben, for the 200 extra bits. Thank you so, 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 so much. Um... Zapdos could get the KO as well, but why would I do that? 
right? Why would I actually do that? Do I bench the Oricorio? I feel like I shouldn't bench the Oricorio. Yes, it gets me extra cards, but do I need extra cards? Um, Guzmahala gets me the Recycle Energy and the Thunder Mountain, so that's really good. That's really, really good. Do I need to do that now, though? I don't think I need to. It gets me another Lucky Egg as well. <clears throat> okay, I am going to bench the Oricorio purely because... Um, because there's, I could get reset stamp, right? I take three prizes and I could get reset stamp. And what better way to recover from reset stamp than drawing three, drawing four turn, having still wish, and having three more? Yeah, I think I like that. Yeah. So spark wheel. I can't discard this because I need it to be able to access the attack. So then there's the Poke Doll. And we get our three prize cards. Three prize cards. All right. All right. Well, there's the greens. Right. There's a green. Uh, my opponent can't beast game. They can elegant soul for 220. That would be fine though. Is there any way for me to get four custom catchers here? That would be insane. Okay, tax switch and custom catcher. Max switch and custom catcher. Okay, so three prizes on the Oricorio, that's fine. <laughs> Thank you so much, Ruben, once again for the 200 bits. That's amazing. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so, so much for the support. It means the world. Yeah, it means the world means the world to me. Okay, so still wish a Rooney. Okay, well I have the recycle now. Okay, I also have Coco Prism. I only have two electro powers. So there's no way for me to KO this guy. Uh, I don't care that I don't attach another energy to another Morpeko. Like, this Morpeko is basically unkillable at this point. <laughs> this is so weird, though. This happened yesterday. Why does this happen? <laughs> Why does that happen? Okay, now I'll attach the Recycle. And now I can just keep reusing the Recycle. Um, I'll go ahead and Guzma, huh? An energy and the Zapdos. For the lucky egg for that. Oh, I haven't taken my medicine today. Good thing I set my alarm. Oops. Okay, I need to take my medicine. Yeah, don't forget. Don't forget, people. Don't forget. Um, okay, so let's go. A well, let's tell wish first. That's pretty sweet. Uh, this is probably better actually than the custom catcher. Just to give my opponent less options. For next turn and basically what I'm looking for is um, to be able to draw extra cards to 10 not enough I'll just electro wheel and I'll get rid of the recycle they just the recycle gets goes back <laughs> and Rafa thank you so much that's six thousand bits today thank you so much thank you so much for the extra 300 so the lucky egg i guess is not that impactful in the end it's only two extra cards but you never know right you never know oh i do have water i did drink water there we go
Right. Um, Syndicate lane, Poke Gear. We have 50 50 chance to just outright win <clears throat> next turn, which is really nice. Do you have any any social media? Oh, I'll, I'll just message you directly. Do you have Twitter? Do you have Twitter? Yeah, Twitter. Okay, cool Mahala. My opponent playing a bunch of cards to thin, but they already played Cynthia Caitlyn, so this is fine. And wow, <laughs> 500 more bits, Rafa, thank Ruben, thank you so much. Thank you so, so, so much. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so much. So, 50% chance to just outright win, nope, um, I'll go ahead and switch, uh, there's no card I can find here, well the Volkner helps me thin, right? The Volkner helps me thin and that's awesome. Okay, so then I'll go, I think I'll just attach the metal, I'll retreat. I'll bench another Jirachi. In case my opponent decides to attack, then I can just um, get the Lucky Egg going. Now I have one Volkner and three Custom Catchers of 19 cards. If my opponent chooses not to attack, then that's fine. Because all they're doing is not losing, but they're not getting any closer to winning. Thank you so much for the 500 bits, Ruben. Thank you so, so much. Lose, I mean, all damage done to your Ultra Beast by attacks. Oh, okay, so we can't win this turn either, <laughs> even though I topped it this, so we'll just pass. That's fine, right? Okay, so it's like I said, my opponent is not losing, but he's not getting anywhere close to winning. There's no way for him to deal 300 damage. So more Pico VMAX is about to take its first victim. Alana heals, that's fine. We finally have the two custom catchers in hand. <clears throat> and if we didn't, we would have a Stellar Wish plus a draw three, so we'll be looking at the next nine cards in my deck. And there's no point in delaying. We will just go ahead and bop this person with max discharge there we go very very nice can you use more pico's v's attack with more pico v max cage it's because i have a memory energy attached is this deck the true stones no it's not the true stones i don't know this is literally the first and only game i've played with the deck um so i don't know yeah <laughs> <coughs> i don't know um, Ruben, yes, Ultra Prism on is the current standard format. Yeah, Ultra Prism on is the current standard format. Okay. So yeah, I had the memory energy cage. That that's why I was able to use the attack. Yeah. That's why I was able to use the attack. Okay. Would you like to go first? No, thank you. No, thank you. Nido Queen is pretty good. Nido Queen with um, Nido Queen with um, 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 Intellion. You mean? I could see that being good. I will build it eventually. I think. <clears throat> All right. This might be a mirror match, or this just might be Picarum. Yeah, it's Picarum. Look at him. Picarum. Right. Yeah. 
Yeah, not a bad start for my opponent. Not a bad start at all. Um, <clears throat> no, Ruben, so all the, all the Hidden Fates cards, you know, they have an A. Okay, the shiny Pokemon from Hidden Fates, they have an A um, in the bottom. That means they're alternate art, and that means um, you can't... Um, that means you can't use them, unfortunately. That means you can't use them unless the the other version is standard legal, and Zorak GX is no longer a standard legal card. Yeah, so unfortunately, we cannot we cannot use that. Um, sure, Absol. This is like counterintuitive. I put the Lucky Egg, but then I'm putting Absol to make it harder for my opponent to to set up. Um, I mean, I would love to attach to Amor Pico, but I would also love to just not Vetro like I currently am. I have the other cycle. My memory energy is prized, so that's that could be a problem. Could be a big problem. Okay. And we'll pass. I mean, I am rooting for my opponent to KO me, but hopefully they don't. Yeah, in Expanded you can play the Shiny version, but in Standard you can no longer play Zorak GX. The C Cynthia you can. Yeah, Cynthia you can. So there, there are some of the Shiny Pokemon that are still Standard Legal, but there are others that are not Standard Legal anymore. Unfortunately... Another quick wall. <laughs> Stadium nav. I won't mind the Thunder Mountain being played. <laughs> I won't mind the Thunder Mountain being played, but that ended up not happening. That ended up not happening. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you've been out for a while, Ruben. But I mean, generally, Sword and Shield is definitely the best time to make a comeback into the game. Yeah. So goodbye Zapdos. Oh no. <sighs> <coughs> wow, I was so scared right there. <clears throat> I was so so scared. Okay, ours up the the choo choo, but there's still the potential for attack bolt KO, right? Um so I can find Thunder Mountain if it's in there, which I'm not actually quite sure if it is. Um, okay. Alright. So let's go Rosa. Or do I just go for more Pico VMAX? That wouldn't be terrible, honestly. Oh, but I can't. I can't do it this turn. Um, I guess I'll grab Ori Choreo. And then obviously I'll grab a Lightning. Okay. So I am guaranteed an attack. I can... I do want to turn around to I should be doing this in better order. Dance of Tributes. I do find that switch. Is that useful at all? Not quite. Um, attack World is so scary though. Tag Wolf is so, so scary. I'm gonna have to give up on a Jirachi. I'm fairly sure. Yeah, this hand is just awful. But nothing else to do, really. Alright, Electro Wheel. 
Oh, no, 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 why did I do that? Oh, that's such a waste of a lucky egg. Oh my god. I grab a Mew. I don't think their list runs Mew, does it? I forgot. <laughs> I don't think I have Mew here. If there was Mew, I should have. Oh, the volume is going crazy. Sorry. Thank you for letting me know. What is the best deck in the format? Pigram on ADP? Ah, uh, I'm not sure. Thank you for letting me know. Yeah. Please, please always tell me. Please always tell me about the music. Is it better now? Is the music better now? Hopefully it is. Okay. Pokemon Catcher. Whew. That was insane lucky. Wait, what happened to my hand? Did I? Did my opponent actually reset stab me? Therefore making me draw one card with the lucky egg? Do you know where you can find a Mewtwo list, Worm Townie? Um, for Shady Tree, thanks so much for the follow. For I mean, for standard, for like Mewtwo Malamar, or Limitless. You know, Limitless there are quite a few. Oh, there was a Mew in there. Oops, <laughs> I did not notice. That's on me. That's my bad. That is my bad. I should have noticed that. Um, okay. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get rid of the Jirachi. We need Kogo. There's no Mew. I need my reset stamp, which I believe I lost on turn one. Yeah, so I can't reset stamp my opponent. So it comes down to Pokemon Catcher flips. It literally comes down to Pokemon Catcher flips. Well, no, it doesn't. I can't attack this turn because I'm out of Quick Balls. What the heck? Yep, I'm out of Quick Balls. I'm out of Pokecoms. I can't attack this turn anyways. Oh gosh, this is so bad. Um, I've got already gx There's two Electro Powers gone. He needs two Electro Powers to kill Coco V. And it's literally the only attacker I have. Yep, I have to do this. Uh, I have to do this. So I need to hope that my opponent... Oh no, wait, I, I can still do this. Okay, so I, I'm gonna still wish first. Yeah, I'm gonna still wish first. And then maybe I can get a more Pico off of this. I don't, I get another Coco, jeez. Alright, well, better than nothing, I guess. <clears throat> Okay, so Dance of the Ancients, we get the weird graphic. Yeah, I can attack with Coco V, but the issue is I leave the Coco V in the active and my opponents have two prizes. So if I could have attacked with more Pico, then I can leave as Pokedol in the active, and that's way, 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 way better, of course. Um, but yeah, like I, I have game if I can get my other Electro Power from the prize cards after I knock out this Picaron. Right? If I get my own, if I survive, right? That's step number one. If I survive, yeah, there's a well played. Uh, yeah, I needed more Pico, and I did get the Electro Power. I did get the Electro Power. So I was just holding two Electro Powers. Oh, Tax Switch, Tax Switch, right? So Coco V KOs mine, Coco V. So this is why I needed more Pico. Yeah, I need to KO with more Pico to prevent this from happening. <laughs> Come on, don't pull around. I needed um, I need more Pico to have a doll in the active, not a two prizer that just gets knocked out and I lose. Um, so that's why. Like I, I knew I could attack, but I couldn't win the game. So yeah. Um, is the music better now? Yeah, I hope it is, because there's been no other mention of it. I hope the music is better now. <clears throat> Excuse my cough. Sorry about my cough. I'm still not at a hundred percent.
I would like to go first. No, thank you. Okay, terrible start. <laughs> terrible start. I can attach a skateboard, play the doll, play switch, play electro bar, and custom match over two. And we're up against Malamar. Mew 3 Malamar, you would expect. Mew 3 Malamar. Oh, Worm Townie, you can find Mew 3 Malamar list that I featured yesterday on the stream on my YouTube channel already, and the list is in the description. Yeah, I remembered. <laughs> so you can check that out as well. Ooh, Lily, so is this like old school Malamar? <clears throat> is this old school Malamar? And then my opponent discard Lily thinking, I don't know. Lily is not good anymore, because going first sucks now. <laughs> like if you end up going first, then um, you just, your lilies become terrible cards. And that's two lilies my opponent got rid of. Uh, okay, I really do appreciate the Viridian Forest though. Okay, so let's do this. I think I'm just gonna get rid of the Rosa. I'm just gonna play everything down. Heads, that's good, do that. Oh wait, I can, maybe, I can KO the Inke. I can attack turn one. Right, maybe I can KO the Inke. Um, all right. <laughs> Three more. Uh, this gets me. There's no Tedena in the list. This gets me Jirachi for later, but or Oricorio, but I'm not getting KO'd, right? Sure, Jirachi seems like the, the right call here. And then we'll go Lily's Pokeball. What a very, like a very underwhelming start. I'm not liking just the reliance on pure Volkner for sure. But we got some damage in. My opponent's turn one was super underwhelming, so that's why you don't want to go first. I went second and I still didn't get a supporter, but meh. Yeah, meh. But do I feel it's the most powerful deck so far? I do think Seijin and Mew3 are on, a, on another level compared to the other decks. Like in terms of speed, in terms of raw power. Um, I do think those two are um, better. And proper good, thank you so much for Subscribing, thank you so much for choosing to subscribe. I don't know why we didn't get a notification chat, but proper good, thank you so, so much for subscribe. Oh, it was a follow or a subscription? Now I'm not sure. It showed us a subscription, right? Oh, maybe that was on YouTube. Maybe that was on YouTube, a new YouTube subscriber. That's probably it, I don't know. Um, okay, so we get Hypnosis, and we do not wake up. We can retreat with the escape board, but I don't really want that. Um, this is Mew3 Mali. So... Ugh. The Drill Memory Energy, which I'm not a fan of. I definitely think I need more Memory Energies, for sure. And I'll just pass. What an awkward game, for sure. What an awkward, awkward game for both of us, you know? You really shouldn't be playing Lily anymore, though. There's a treasure. I think Seishan and Mew3 are on another level. Okay. Another Malamar immediately evolves. And then Cynthia's. Only one psychic in this card pile. So my opponent needs a good amount. He could just retreat as well. <clears throat> so we're not getting attacked this turn by Spiritina. Finds Lily again. Yeah, I was probably a YouTube subscriber, that was the notification. Lost a custom catcher, that's good news. 
Damage to the bench people, that's not the end of the world. Damage on the Jirachi is annoying for sure. Why does Marpico have a to retreat us? Why are you fat, Marpico? You're like a fast mouse. Why are you fat when you have a to retreat us? Alright. And very nice. So I can knock out. I feel like I should, right? Eliminating a Malamar? Why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I? I need Spark. <coughs> I don't see a universe where <laughs> I attack, I Spark three more times, but it's definitely the best target, I feel. Uh, my Morpico is going down, but there was no point in going for a Lucky Egg because I was not going to... Um, <clears throat> I was not going to find one, I mean to be able to attach it to the active. So now my Morpico is going down. There's a Lily for 3, I insist. Not a great idea to be playing that. I don't think we're winning this one. Lily is slightly worse if you go second. You still can draw to eight. Yeah, but I mean, Professor's research is always seven. Lily is draw two eight, right? So it could be draw one, could be draw two, could be draw eight, but research is always seven. And that is huge. Okay. So things are not looking great here. <coughs> for our more Pico hero. Generally because like we never we just never got going. You know? We simply never ever got going. Um so I do need the energy and I will grab the lucky egg. I think that makes the most sense. So I'll go ahead and do this, I'll go ahead and do this, I'll go ahead and do this, go ahead and do this, and then I'll go ahead and do this. And then I will get a fresh hand here. I will get a fresh hand. I will be behind in prize cards. Big time. And I should not have attached the energy to the Coco V now that I've seen it. Should have gone to the Morpico. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. Okay, so I think this will be um, <clears throat> I think this will be my last game. I'm starting to feel my throat be very, very sore. Um, so <clears throat> so yeah. I think this will be the last game for me today. I will try to stream later again today though, hopefully. But my throat, yeah, my throat is starting to hurt quite a bit. Maybe I'll push through. Wow, Pedro! <laughs> Pedro, thank you so much. Okay, I will definitely push through. Pedro, thank you so much for the host. That's very kind of you. How are you doing, my friend? Are you ready? Are you ready for the, the show match on Sunday? Are you ready for the show match on Sunday? Oh no. That's terrible. How is my opponent drawing everything? Discarding three lilies on turn one. And no Jirachi and like what? Yeah, we've lost. Okay. <coughs> Bogonita. Yes, yes. Okay, I'm just gonna concede here. There's no coming back into this match. Um, that will be all for more Pico, but thanks to Pedro's hosts, yeah, thank you to everyone who's here. I will, uh, thanks to Pedro's raid, yeah, I will be featuring another deck, okay? So, and you chat, and wow, Rahul, <laughs> thank you so much for coming in 
with the other host. Thank you so much, Rakul. Welcome to everyone who is new here. Okay, so we have these decks. I feel like Frostmoth should be the next deck. Yeah, Frostmoth will be our next deck. So, <laughs> it's okay, Rahul, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you so much for the hosts, I appreciate it. Um, I will be right back in just a second. I have not tried Stone Journey or VMAX yet, but I do have one built and I will get to that probably on Sunday if I have time to stream, or not Sunday, sorry, on Monday. But um, we're moving on to Frostmoth, don't go anywhere. I will be right back and please say thank you to Pedro and Rahul for motivating me to go for the next deck because even though my my throat is very sore it's worth it yeah to to not disappoint all the new people that just arrived so don't go anywhere i will be right back in just a second after this quick commercial break 